We've noticed that uh, Brock is frame one. Oh man! Because it is frame zero. Because you're already starting. Yeah. But technically, it is, technically, it is a frame one input. Um. So Brock is automatically fastest move in the game. This guy's automatic. So what you have to do is you have to read that they're gonna throw out a rock. So you look at their hand. When you see that their hand's gonna stay closed, they can't be doing paper or scissors. That means they have to go on rock. So you go paper, you read that. But if you see their hands opening up, that means they're either going paper or scissors. It's one of the two. So you choose scissors, so you either at the worst tie or you beat their paper. At, yeah, at the, at the worst you'll tie them because you'll both go scissors. But if you just see something opening up, throw out scissors. If you see it staying closed, throw out paper. So you should all, your hand should always be opening. Rock is technically the worst move in the game if you're playing on a defensive style like that. If you're going aggressive, then you probably don't. You also probably don't want to start with Rock. All of this and, and this guy can't even wave dash. <laughs> all this, all this lab work into Rock Paper Scissors, but this guy doesn't want to learn well, how to wave we dash. Found out, it, we we started reading up on uh, Rock Paper Scissors meta, and we discovered that it's also very yeah. Rock is broken. There you go. Rock is broken. Well, I don't know. Rock's okay. Um. It does. It the game does also change depending on whether it's two out of three. A lot of times, if you can try getting in their head when they're nervous, like try shaking their hand, you kind of try to like feel it out, like what they're gonna go with. But uh, <laughs> so you shake their hand before the game starts. Try to feel what they're going for. If you can tell they're, <laughs> if, if you can tell, <laughs> if you can tell that they're a little nervous about the rock paper scissors, then they're probably gonna throw a rock because it's just like you're already in that hand. Like you don't want to change anything. You're just like, oh, oh. So what you do is you read that. You read that. You read that stuff. <laughs> we now have CD. You read that stuff, and it's paper. You go paper. But if you win, if you win that exchange, you don't want to keep it that way because no, shut up. You don't. You want to keep it that way because, or you don't want to keep it that way because mentality would say, I just won with that matchup. I'm not gonna change. <laughs> It is, dude. The card market. Lama, I want this entire um, like so you lecture. So, if posted. the other person is also informed on the rock paper scissors meta, they're gonna think, "Wow, he just beat me. He thinks that his hand was good. He's probably gonna stay with the same hand because it worked." So you counteract that. But if you know the rock paper scissors meta, you guess that he's gonna guess that you think that you're gonna stay. So you change it. You change <laughs> that. And then he's explaining the meta behind rock paper scissors. And that's basically it. Pirates Wait, it does depend whether it's 2 out of 3 rock. or just 1-1. One, one. Yeah, no, this is very informative. I've thought about this, I've read up on it, I've video analysis on it. it. I watched the Rock, Paper, Scissors MLG World Champions. There was like a $100,000 prize for that. CD calling out Tomo. I think I, I think we watched the same video. Is it where they got out of sync? They're like, that's what we call working on the railroad. <laughs> they're, they're like out of sync, and like the judge calls them off. They're like, hey, wait, you guys have to get on sync. And then the commentators are like, oh, that's what you call working on the railroad right there. <laughs> whenever they tie, like, whenever they, like, two guys throw out rock, they're like, rock tie. <laughs> it's like they got so into it. <laughs> it's the best video on YouTube. Oh my god. Yeah, this yeah, is yeah. a thing. Well, it wasn't, it wasn't that much. This is a real thing. Rock, paper, scissors, man. Rock, paper, scissors, meta. Meanwhile. Yeah, you rock, you rock, paper, scissors, one, or you arm wrestle with one hand, you rock, paper, scissors with the other. It's the best two out of three. You win both. <laughs> it's not exactly, but, you know. <laughs> what? No, this matchup. No, 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 not this matchup. This oh, these people? Oh. Yeah, I don't know. What? what? Where do you doing? find these people? I can I do that. I only sponsor. I can. Ah, man. I question Ooh. ESS's sponsorship Ooh. choices. <laughs> not with Project Dent, not with the, the players, with the, the game. Clearly, you guys need to sponsor Rock, Paper, Scissors. Obviously. 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 Rock, Paper, Scissors meta, though. <laughs> I tried using this at a UW tournament. They had a Rock, Paper, Scissors kind of thing. I lost first round. So I was like, all right, I need to reanalyze. RPS and then, meta confirmed absolute garbage. Well, no, this is before I learned that Rock was a frame one move. So <laughs> Frame zero move. Well, Clearly, you still don't understand the meta. I 
don't need to. Another one. Oh god. Pudge, did what did you just link us with? Yes. Yes, we're clicking it. It's probably the rock, paper, scissors thing. I mean, as long. Pudge, I have no idea. Yeah, who, hey, big, big Pudge, have you been to our tournaments? Apparently, he's a serious Rochambeauer. What if Big Pudge right now is just like some out of state dude? And he's like, he's like talking to all these people and say he's like, guys, check out the stream. They're talking about rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> There's a flood of people come in. They're like, dude, this is sick. <laughs> to rock, paper, scissors. An analysis on rock, paper, scissors with background project him. Right. I think I'd be a great podcaster. <laughs> I agree, Tomo. Oh. Sonic's dashing around. Why, are we Why would you forward throw? That does nothing. <laughs> That's good. No, it's a good stage. Because so Sonic wants room to run around it, but it's like if you don't give him that, then you just beat him up. Where would you do that? You get. You just got destroyed. No. <laughs> it's okay. That was commentary. Why would you do that? No, that happened to me once. I like, like, cried on the inside. Oh, he's gonna do it again. Oh, no. What the heck? Dude, the he's going for the what's the, what's the Sheik's up smash called? Up dynasty, smash. the dynasty, the dynasty move. Yeah, she, he he went for like a charge dynasty attack. And like, this. Oh, you're getting it. Oh, oh. Shock round Y. Shock round smiling. He's like, I meant to do that. <laughs> I think the sad part is he probably did. You watch Jamie come back. Jamie can come. Jamie can bring this back. He could, but will he? Jamie needs a grab. Why? What? Bruh. No. <laughs> Kill your sister. I think I think she's recovery going farther than that. We're getting on stream next.